What is going on ladies and gentlemen, Monkey Flop here and today I wanted to talk about some gaming news but then also talk about the state of YouTube and where we're headed. Hopefully you guys stay with me until the end of the video so that we get the entire information of everything that I want to share with you guys here today. Um, if you guys do enjoy these videos, you already know what to do. If you guys are new, make sure to subscribe with those bell notifications turned on. Let's go ahead and get right into it. So I mean, first things first, let's go ahead and talk about the PlayStation Plus Instant Game Collection. As many of you guys may or may not have heard, we got Modern Warfare Remastered and the witness for the PlayStation 4. Now, a lot of people are praising Sony for the fact that we get good games, and they're saying that uh, quality over quantity is much more preferred. And even though some most people already own Modern Warfare Remastered, some people are really excited to be able to play it for the first time. If you guys have never played a Call of Duty, this is probably a good one to start off with. Um, I'd love to know your guys' thoughts and opinions in the comment section below about the Instinct Game Collection. A lot of people are, again, praising Sony, but there's some people that are like, oh my gosh, we only got two games now. Uh, the two games are decent, not bad, good job Sony. But at the same time, they're like, we, including myself, it kind of feels lonely without the PlayStation 3 and the Vita. And considering the fact that for the PlayStation 3 and the Vita's games that were available for free, some of them were cross-play with the PlayStation 4, which means that for the past, you know, how many years, when they gave us free games for the PlayStation 3 and the Vita, we were able to play it on the PlayStation 4, and I thought that was pretty cool, and it kind of feels lonely with just two games. We went from six games a month to two games. We'll have to wait and see what Sony's got up their sleeves for April. Uh, but this month, so far, fans are excited about the announcement. Really quickly, I did want to mention that Devil May Cry has a free demo. And I know I've mentioned this before, but I wanted to mention it again because I don't think a lot of people actually took advantage of the fact that there's a free demo. And anytime there's a free demo on the PlayStation Network Store, it's actually a perfect time to give it a shot, give it a go, and see if it's your cup of tea. Other than watching other people play it, which is cool, and you kind of get a feel of, you know, what the game's going to be like for your own personal pleasure and enjoyment, um, there's nothing like playing the game for yourself. So if you guys have not checked out Devil May Cry 5's demo, it's available right now on the PlayStation Network Store. Now, I did want to mention, this video is not sponsored by the way, um, we're just talking about some general gaming news here. Uh, we have Fortnite Season 8 available, and by unpopular slash popular demand, you guys wanted me to mention that in today's video. Um, and well, a lot of people are like praising, you know, Epic Games, like, oh yeah, oh yeah, we got new a new season, new Battle Pass. There's a lot of people that are kind of seeing that the Battle Pass is a little bit boring, a little bit stale um, for their cup of tea. Now, me personally, I'm pretty much biased because I don't play Fortnite. I played it back in the day when it wasn't cool. <laughs> When it first got released, you know, when the story mode was more popular than the... Okay, you guys get it. But, um, nevertheless, um, I wanted to mention that. Um, I rather play Realm Royale. And if a couple of you subscribers that want to play and join in with me, I'm going to be doing a, a play date uh, next week on Wednesday. So stay tuned for that if you want to drop your PSN names down below. Of course, if you guys are members, um, I will make sure that you guys get in, um, but it, it's going to be open to anybody um, that wants to play with me uh, on Wednesday of next week. did want to mention a PlayStation VR game because, you know, PlayStation VR really doesn't get that much love, and Beat Saber is one of those cardio games that it makes everybody crazy addicted to and uh, a couple of people have broken some arms and fingers over a no big deal no big deal but they do have new dlc available so if you guys have beat saber and playstation vr um definitely check out the dlc that's going to be released in march next up we got cyberpunk 77 which will make an appearance at e3 this year and a lot of people are really excited about cyberpunk in E3 this year. 
I'd love to know your guys' thoughts and opinions about that game in those comments down below. Next up, we have a Gearbox announcement, guys. And this one is pretty cool because we get official announcement that they will be at PAX East. Not only will they be at PAX East, but they blocked an entire hour for some sort of reveal. And I will let you guys kind of guess what that reveal might be in those comments down below. Let, let, let me know what that reveal might be. Wink, wink. <laughs> Let's go. I want to mention there's 40 new avatars for Dragon Quest available on the PlayStation Network Store right now as we speak. If you guys are into Dragon Quest, definitely go check that out. I did want to touch on the state of YouTube because it's kind of sticky. There's a lot of stuff going on. And honestly, I've been doing a lot of stuff behind the scenes. Um, as many of you guys may or may not have heard, Machinima is no longer. All right, so the next part of this video will be uploaded later on today. Honestly, it's been very hard to film. And um, yeah, so hopefully you guys stay tuned for the next part of this video. Uh, part two will be released later on today. And we're going to be discussing, um, you know, the fate of YouTube. <laughs> and everything in between so thank you guys so much for watching if you guys are new make sure to hit that subscribe button bell notification enable all i will see you guys in the next news update you guys are freaking awesome